Greetings and welcome back to another episode of Why the Hell Am I Doing This Mission? Oh boy, 16 to 18 enemies on a regular gorilla or hack the objective mission just to find a UFO. Menace 1 5, this is Avenger. The access sure. point we're after is just ahead. Move to secure the area, expect hostile resistance. Now, part of the plan here is to. That feels really far away. What do we have there? Super heavy turret, purifier. We do have a good old saturation fire shadow strike. If we can't bring that to, to bear, if we can't take advantage of that, that would be a huge detriment to the okay. mission. So we need to be a little bit careful here with scouting. We've got a hacky tower over there. Your queen listens. And you know, having 16 to 18 enemies on the mission and you don't even see anything when blue moving on the first turn. Okay. Spooky. Okay, what do we have? What do we have in the tower? A group fire on the hill. Oh, and that's a drone. Okay. So part of my idea here for this mission was to get an early drone with full override, to have another body on our side, to have a stun, etc. etc. Uh what do we got? Squad precision at 44%. Now, correct me if I'm wrong, if I have failed save, prevent any negative effects from failed tax. So I can just do this, and even if we fail, we don't get revealed, and obviously, I know we don't take out reinforcements, I'm just... Confirming. Okay, this is for two turns. 25% crit. So yeah, it might be something worth picking up, but it's probably not worth picking up right now. Onwards. A little bit in with you. Rain on this mission. We'll probably have to move up here. Going through here and then coming up next to the objective seems really risky. Um, let me actually do this differently. Let's bring you on. Yeah, 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 got it. Holy detection range, Batman. Vigilance uh, is a fun set trap that really opens up the map for you. Affirmative. We are without limit. I trust this. This is the typical the full cover next to the the, the corner full cover where it's like yeah you know you're actually not in cover at all. Get wrecked. Um, something I'm just gonna go here. Just like the astral winds. You can just jump. Here comes dichter op het doel. Ooh, double super heavy mech. Seriously, double super heavy mag? That looked fun. Okay, um... Let's do the script. Let's just... Get that squad precision, or don't get it, but it disabled the tower. Oh, so close. Okay. 
Like, of course, full overriding a super heavy mech might be even better, but we're, we're never getting a full override on that thing. Like, not even close. I think the super heavies should be far enough away that the drone will not get revealed here and will remain concealed. It might even give us some scouting information. Yes. Okay. Now, I did say moving up here and then fighting up this is a bad idea, but um, I think not killing any enemies and trying to move up here and then fighting 16 to 18 enemies all at once is probably even worse. Ah. Oh, yeah, we didn't disable the tower. Um, I see both of them now. Yes, okay. And move. What's that? Oh, that's in the tower range. Faster! Okay, over there. This would have been a nice spot for you. Good to go. Have a schmover. Righto. Looking forward to it. So the mechs are just gonna stand there and go on overwatch if we activate. Um, I think we're just gonna... On my way. Gonna do this here. Get the drone, get those mechs a little bit shredded. What are we rocking today? Blue screen, yeah, fantastic. I got these. Covers blown. Combat protocol is what? Fifteen to sixteen. Need to move up, obviously. Well, here's the big question. Are you going to be in range to... No, you're one tile too short. I mean, I need some focus. Alright, let me just get rid of that overwatch, yeah? Oh yeah, we also get combat music. Move you up. I know not plan that. I'm, I'm really debating using teamwork just to get some focus here. Can I heat it? I think we have to.
Yorokin, Yorokin. Let's see. That's for Angel. All right. Not really the right number of enemies I was hoping to take out with the first attack, and it, this this tower is is annoying. So I think I want you over here to come up this way. Is that the safest way for me to look up there? Probably not. M maybe. Good. Maybe we just come up here, have a look around. This is the least crowded 16 to 18 enemies mission I've ever done. Uh huh. We are without limit. Our destiny awaits. Is happening here. Let's keep moving. Yeah, I think we just this turn bring everybody up. Come on. A little bit short on the timer. Huh? Let's get going. I'm only debating if I want to position you up there. No, I think I, I need to bring everybody Running. up the ramp here. I tire of waiting. Okay. I wonder if there's groups over there. Or, ooh, I saw something on the edge there. Pay attention. Okay. Ah, yeah, that's that's the kind of thing I was looking for. Well, that's an easy group. Except for the Archon, of course, having um, CCS. And I don't see them anymore. Well, here's a question. Where do I have to be to hack the objective? So I probably have to go, go under the thing. I want to hack the tower this turn. I would have to go up here. Okay. Let's see how we're we going to do this. Move Coming. over here. Scout, if there's anything to the left, nothing. All right, and then we're gonna take the drone. Lie up here to trigger. And then hide behind this thing so they can't come at me, bro. Pretty much exactly what I wanted.
Give you a little, little dose of the good old rapid fire. Burning should disable his close combat specialist. That means you can go in. Get your fourth point of focus. So we can apotheosis next turn. Triumph through sacrifice. Okay. So kind of think we have to hack the turret here. There's no group here that I left out. Uh, okay, I also have to throw an evac. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. As a second turret right behind it. I, I don't think I can go for control here. No, especially not at 67. Do combat protocol against next turn. That almost takes care of the turret. Okay, so then you come in here. What is it this time? You move up here. Finally. Oh, I could also. Are you, you one-shotting this? Probably. Got something. What? Oh, core, 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 core? Double core. Okay, that means you could. That guy. You never stood a chance, Zeratul. Come on. It's sixteen to eighteen enemies. How are we at the objective and we've only seen and killed six? This is so concerning here. No time like the I mean, there's definitely going to be something inside here, so if I move here to look inside... Awkward... I mean, I don't have to kill the 16 to 18 enemies. Get a sneaky hack in. We could probably hack from the window. Uh, either from the window or from the door, so we either need to push left or we need to push, I think pushing in here makes more sense. So... Uh, drone? Yeah. The drone can open the door for me. I'm not even asking how you're seeing these. What I'm asking is... Can I get... I can get an angle on the hacking. Yeah. Let's do that then. Smell, smell, smell. 
Look, yeah, there are 16 to 18 enemies on the map. Nobody says I need to kill these guys. It's killing time! Conserving a little bit of ammo, yeah? No time like the present. Oh, really? How did you spot that one? My conquest continues. And get the strip ammo. Hmm. We were there and ran over here. Probably like taking the step over this thing might have triggered it. I don't even know. It's been in this tile before. That didn't trigger. Ah, uh, remember my first gunfight. I'm just gonna stay here. I'll cover you. I, I was imagining. When starting this mission, uh, we're gonna have an epic, huge gunfight. But if we get a sneaky hack in next turn and then just disappear when the evac comes, I'm okay with that. I think. Ah. All right. That's one of the groups that was behind there. There was a yeah, a great archon that was seen. Alright, so we're gonna get the objective. Let's just take the watch list, sure. He has an interesting idea to make hacking more interesting. It's like a, a chance for a critical success where you get both rewards. Come on, 15. Son of a gun. There's another turret. Oh, and we got the Archon. Alright, alright. And an Elite Priest. And a Vanguard. And a Purifier. Okay. And I can't even Drone Shock the mech. Alright. I see how it is. And we got reinforcements coming in next turn. Okay. Uh, what are we doing on a vault here? Five to eight. That doesn't feel great. Problem is, obviously, I can't. Hmm. I can't do do the thing. I can't apotheosis and attack him because it's a freaking mutant. So. I think the stuff that's back here is probably not going to be super dangerous this turn. I'm a little bit scared of the priest. The Great Archon is, of course, always a great threat. 
Um, but we can hopefully set him on fire or something. I think we we need to go wild here. Invert on the civilian. No, invert on the. Invert on the Centurion. Oh, that's another great Archon. Oh, great. Oh, they were already part of the um, count that we were having. Okay, I'm like, oh, we already were at 16 active. Yeah. Okay. Well, on the bright side, you can do some some work here. Right, this is gonna be a whole turn, isn't it? Okay. Reinforcements coming in. Yeah. All right. So uh, we've got the epic firefight. I was hoping for. You're gonna have to get in range of that Archon and disable his CCS. I don't see a point from where you can do that. Outside of here, out in the open. To be a little bit closer to get your both barrels to bear. Does that help us in any way to get to a position where I can shoot the Archon without standing? My cheeks flapping in the wind here. Not really. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. CCS is a dark event. Not everybody has CCS. Here do you have CCS. Why do you not have a circly dirkly around you then? Can I afford... A double teamwork here. So just have Paulo come up. Rapid fire this Archon. Teamwork. Shoot this Archon. Hopefully, a little bit of luck, get both of them set on fire. Then we can finish off the mech. Hide somewhere, shield up. Hopefully, outside of range of the two turrets. Then we just have two Sectoids, a Purifier, Vanguard, and two Burning Archons very angry at us. And a drone to hopefully take some hits. I don't like that you're sitting in low cover there. All right. Whatever. Uh. Made him angry, but did not set him on fire. I am with you. I think I don't care about the the 
Archon in the center here, if he's on fire or not. Made him even more angry, still not on fire. You know, then I'll just kill you. you have the power. I, I like that. I you like them apples. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Ah, teamwork. Makes the dream work. I'm assuming you're gonna be in line of sight of the tower if I move here. So let's not do that. Just move here or something. Alright. Ah. I think we're gonna apple, even though we just have three focus and not four. Bit of the Mac. Give me some focus for next turn, and then I think we're just gonna. I kind of like the idea of breaking line of sight with the sectoids, so they have to come around here a little bit. I am flanking myself, though, to anyone coming through the door. And there's the, the purifier. No, so let's just go here. Our path is clear. Shield up. And drone is just gonna be a fancy target, okay. Alright. <sighs> well we're dropping boys. Eight no heavy mech. Not super heavy, okay. Lancer and a grenadier. Of some description. Opinions? Double move, nothing else, alright. Works for me. Your first like, yeah, I can do that too. Vanguard, that also looked like a double move, wasn't that? Holy warrior on the Vanguard, sure, why not? But you need to move, you can't stay up. You can, you have, st oh yeah, right. That is, that is, that is not good. That is a... Uh, very unfortunate stasis. Okay, you do AoE nothing, I think. One of my favorite moves. Right. That hurts. That hurts a little bit here. What do we do about the frickin' Vanguard? I do have some ideas, that's okay. I think so here the most sensible thing is to reload and rapid fire the the Arco.
You're not getting a flank on the purifier here? This thing inside full cover? Oh yeah, this is a full cover object, okay. Can I disorient you? No, he's too far away. Crap. Let's move this. An inferior life form. I think we're gonna hit this guy. The Templar is never above trouble. Oh, those reinforcements weren't actually technically active. Cool. Fantastic. Just just what the doctor ordered. And I don't have my implacable move anymore. I only have my my other move. So we can easily kill the Lancer here. Wondering if I do something risky to kill the Purifier. Can I get you somewhere here? I, I kinda was thinking I need to see the Vanguard. In order to then command, and then I can can void conduit him. Okay. Then move you here first. down to which position do I like um, the least here. Wait, hang on. You see the vanguard from where you are? Why did I think you didn't see him there? So I can just shield. Can do something with my first action and then command. If I move up here, we're gonna get shot by a thousand turrets. It's 
engineer he's gonna flashbang us which is fine we can we can get rid of that all right so you're just gonna run there hopefully finish off that sectoid Yeah, I think you just come here. It's kind of, kind of wild that this has a lot of side to the Vanguard here. I don't expect that. Maybe you go here. Do you care about being another side of the Vanguard? Not really. But that gives me the option to run up there. We need to do something about the turrets next turn. Yeah. Okay. And yes, there's a heavy mech, which I have nothing, uh, no real answer for. And I'm not sure if this now cancels my, my shield. But well, it cancels the Vanguard. No, I still have my ablative from the shields. What if I shield up again? Do I get double the ablative? Nobody knows. Okay, um, I think that's my turn. Who sees the turrets? I still see. Po oh, the, the drone. Yeah, the drone is gone. Rip drone. You can take down one of the turrets next turn. Did not have line of sight to the turret here, but the turret sees me. Makes sense. Look out! Ah, yeah, eighty two miss. You Good fact. And we get reinforcements. <laughs> okay. Oh shit, we need to kill this turn. I think we need to start with the vanguards. Fine, fine. That's Skaljack on the Priest, probably. Yeah, I mean, Vanguard is burning and is ruptured, so it's basically dead. Don't care about you anymore. Oh, no! Well... On the one hand, oh no, on the other hand, hey, I'm up here now and I can hack one of those turrets. It's an engineer on Overwatch. Who gives a crap? Uh, okay, so I'm just gonna vault. Vault you. 
Let me double check here. You need to. What do we call this? Then you need to come up here, rapid fire this turret. We vault there. Punch the mech. Then probably kill the mech with a shot. Implacable somewhere, maybe kill the engineer. Maybe shoot the mech twice. Alright, what's on a 93? If I move you back here, then you're standing in the way and you probably can't reach the sector. No, you can still reach the sector. So I move you here. Our path is clear. Giving you 10% more to hit. Rapid fire the turret. You can't handle me. You actually got a shot for whatever reason. Oh, I kind of completely, you know, it's like, oh, I, did, I didn't skullject the priest, whatever. Then we're just, just not going to kill him. Um. <laughs> yes, yeah, probably not the smartest move. Okay, so I guess, I guess we ignore the sectoid and just go for the priest here. It seems reasonable. We got Bladestorm. We set him on fire. Don't set him on fire. Okay, and then you're just gonna overwatch. That's gonna get eaten by the reinforcements. Just thinking we can overwatch kill the the, the engineer. Ah, uh, well, that's uh, maybe the reinforcements land somewhere where we don't hit them. Okay, do this. Yeah, if they get drop in back there, we should be fine. And I think everybody's in range to get out of here next turn because that is that is a uh, reinforcement group. Shock trooper, longbow, and so shield para. Nothing again, the most dangerous move. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. Okay, we got Overwatch to run. I mean, you have five health. Let me double check. You can make it to the evac. You can make it to the evac. You two can make it to the evac. Yeah, we, we're good. We're good. Mm. 
Yeah, I think that you have to run the the, the Overwatch. Tired of waiting around. Taking heavy fire. Come on, give me that. I earned this. Oh, whatever. Saturated. Just because we can. Our destiny awaits. Doubles or snow. Come on, over here. And just for good measure. No time like the present. Bradford sends his regards. Nothing stops the war. What is it this time? Good. Time. We're out of here. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. I have no idea what the sector commanders are trying to do when they do their AoE nothing, but it it feels broken. That they waste that whole turn on just doing a fancy animation. So they have two moves, right? AoE resurrection, where all the all the bodies get you know, zombies, etc. Which sometimes they do um, when they see a lot of corpses, and if they are not advent corpses, of course, they don't get any zombies out of it. Um, in this case, there was the purifier. They should have at least gotten one zombie. The other thing they can do is AoE mind spin, where they basically do a mind spin on every one of your, your squad. But. Either they didn't have anyone in range. I didn't even see a resist message or immunity message from our mind shield. I don't know. Maybe they need a little bit more psi offense. Although, you know, if they hit the whole spot with an AoE mind spin, that's that's devastating. Right? If everybody suddenly panics. Um, it's it's a tricky thing to balance. So it was probably in both cases AoE mind spin and just I resisted the attack. Keep in mind we, we had full will going in and we have an officer who raises everybody's will. The reckless actions of a few misguided dissidents today. We stand with the elders. Trust in their wisdom and we shall overcome this crisis. Anyway, um, for this mission. Good work out there, Commander. We're one step closer to taking back our planet. We got ourselves a rapid fire, and we got ourselves a double tap. I'm looking forward to that. I, I still, I'm wondering if this is actually strong enough, or if, if it wouldn't have been stronger to just do the same thing we did on our other guy and get the pistol skills. For 40 AP, we could have gotten Fanfire, Lightning Hands, Quick Draw. But, like, Fanfire kind of requires you to start your turn in a, in a position where you can lay in the enemy, into the enemy. And this is basically on, we move to a flank, hit and run, pop double tap, shoot, second shot from double tap is then the rapid fire, getting four shots with the rifle off. We'll see. We got to William Cross out of this. And most importantly, the U4 mission. With a nine day timer and vigilance again, because why not? Alright. Setting course for Sector 2. 
Australia. Oh, we're looking willpower wise though. You don't free, well, you all don't free. So, um, yeah, definitely gonna bring Shake It Baby here. I think. Maybe. Ah, that's. Go for a sweet, sweet victory. What? 27, 27 to 25? Mm, that was almost correctly pronounced. Um, that's a big U of O. So I definitely want our, our Gunner Ranger team here in action again. And I kind of feel like, yeah, you know what? If I get Wilmo in there with Holly, then they get the remaining um, Team work Reno, so I can do the teamwork training for the next level there. Okay. Then let's look at the the threshold here. Do I double up on officer here? That gives us something to hack. You're not gonna be officer though, because you know there's a higher ranking officer there. That that gives you the remaining five XP for the level up. I, I like the idea. It's not like we have so many missions going that I need all my officers somewhere else. Can show the blaster gauntlet around. Okay, then I like probably one of our snipers. And at least one psionic. Now it is busy on, it, on the other mission, so yeah, you come here. Um, June Advanced Psy Amp. Should probably have a good armor for you. Alright. We're just gonna steal a storm gun. Sure, why not? Easy Psy PCS, how we're looking on that front. Advanced with 11. What are you doing anyway? Not really anything you need Psy offense for, do you? Outside of mind spin and sanity kind of thing. Whatever, it'll, it'll be fine. Um, we'll think about this later. Um, what else did I want to check? You are rocking a superior hacking 20. Think this is all fine. Like, I could uh, give you a better shotgun and give you a tier 2 holo target if I really wanted to, but no. um, I, think, I think we're good to go.
Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. Alright, meanwhile. Setting course for Sector 7, Western Europe. Go and make all that. Okay, no, hang on. Are we, are we doing this? Should probably pick up those Avengers supplies. plotting new course. Oh, supplies coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen now. I had high hopes for the resistance oh, yeah. of your leadership, Commander. And you have out uh, chosen. Yourself. What's the chosen? Ooh. That's firewalls. Which is kind of. Hang on. Firewalls. Is that the permanent one? Yes. That's kind of lucky that that hasn't been in effect yet. Fed campaigns where this was one of the first permanent arguments they got, and hacking just got even more awful than it already is. Um, am I curious enough to review this? No. Let's sit on 200 intel, we might need it. Alright. Grab these supplies. Oh, hang on. What's that? 50? Okay, I guess we're revealing the dark event. Alien Cypher. Okay, we definitely want to counter that. 15 day timer is um, fairly generous. Strength 4 region. Um, let me get back to you. I think we're going to pick up these supplies. Finish up the training. Well, it's gonna fall into the grinder here. Um, yes, I definitely want you guys to actually be level two teamworked. That's been really annoying me already on a lot of missions that they just had. Our actions have succeeded, and the wow. so fearful. A mission. Okay. I didn't even pay attention. What did we get? Word is oh, the mission. Yeah. No. Mm. Available, <laughs> Maybe we should give them a try. Okay, Australia, we don't want a mission there. That's the, the nasty region. Um, ability points is always a good one. Corpses is always a good one. What do we have for trainings? We could do another in-training with our holo targeter. I think. Can you can you send the same soldier on, on the same mission multiple times? Recover loot for... Um, Ilium course, but I think before I set up another mission, yeah, Bradford, chill. You gotta, you got yeah, yeah, it's fine. Shen is not complaining about the engineer, so you don't have to complain about the ring. Ah. So we got this. Did strength go? Strength went down to four. Um, I don't want to be flying back and forth, and I know I'm. Um, I'm risking a little bit infiltration time here, but strategic resource located. I do this, then we're gonna do go over here. Setting course for Western Europe. Like alien sci-fi is not just a. I kind of want to do this mission, but rather a, we should really do that mission. Um, let's get you guys in here. Uh, I'm going to bring Jet as an officer. What do we bring Nitro? Let's bring Nitro. Then somebody stealthily. You're out there, you're on training, you're on the other mission. Oh. 
I'm missing. I had sent both of you out on that mission. Okay. Wanna go nuts? Let's go nuts. And we might just boost this also. Okay, we are um, a little bit short on stram guns, apparently. You've, you've never shot your weapon, I think. So, whatever. Daddy Home wants armor and vest, and probably some sort of ammo. No, not Shredder. Talon Rounds was the, the idea I was going for. I mean, that feels like a really strong squad, actually. And I'm willing... I think I'm willing to, to boost this. To get all the... Yeah, if we can get 18 crates on this, that's gonna be a real nice... Nice get. And we get some XP here. Okay. Then I think before I infiltrate the other mission, we're gonna pick up the supply drop, head to the black market. Avenger plotting new course. See what we can buy over there. What's this then? Hey! Five day timer. The lip one in this region. Like, I'm a sucker for troop columns. Although with, with such a low enemy number, I don't think we're gonna get good corpses. But hey, if they do the troop column, it's gonna make... It's gonna make the sabotage transmitter easier. Setting course yeah. for Sector 14, East Asia. Um, scrolling all the way down, are we actually going to bring Boomer for scouting on this, this troop column? Or do we just say scouting, schmouting, bring whatever? Would be the mission that brings you yeah, over the over the threshold. And again, that's another one we boost. Oh boy. Play playing expensive here. No, that was not the plan. That is the plan. That's um plating. Also an SMG. You do have Shredder, but kind of running out of 
other weapons. We're running out of armor, so. Wait, why are you wearing a exosuit? If anyone, you should be wearing the exosuit. Uh, you should have the plus one past, huh? For you, get a war armor for you. Siam subcoiler is fine. Never build a second Skulljack? What the hell? That's always the question with your Overwatch Specialist. Do you get Skulljack? Do you get ammo? Do you maybe skip one of these items to get both in? I'd like the Skulljack. I actually want to do a little bit more... Um, Skulljacking to get more intel. Okay, so this is all fine. We could look into this. You still need a vest. I was thinking, if we go on hacking here, then you could get that superior hacking that we have lying around. much for a beam grenade launcher. Good supplies. Okay, we don't have that. Sky Ranger deployed. In position to drop. Avenger plotting new course. Okay, we got the supply drop. Let's hit up the black market. Avenger plotting new course. I'm really considering not buying any of my alloys. Market is open. We have a troop column coming in, we have a supply rate coming in, we have a UFO coming in. That's a lot of additional stuff. Um, I'm considering buying an Ilium core. King, I don't think we need well. I don't think we need that. I need to take a look at weapon attachments at some point. Make sure we're actually using the good stuff. Okay. I think after the UFO and troop column, I'm gonna do another Stelling round. Alright, so. Um, covert action. My 
followers will lead this action to victory. And then the question is, do we have enough? Maybe to to already set up the other mission. At Hopper, we've got Blue back in about a day. Xen. Then. Well, we would have to go all the way down here for an officer. Stun gun assault. So. One thing, it might be too early to already recap the campaign, but I think the um, what I definitely notice is the um, the specs that I don't usually build and that I've been kind of forced to build because hey, we want to have different specs on each shoulder in this campaign end up being on the bottom of the roster. Right, the shooty grenadier. That's that's you know the stun gun assault. suppression gunner like all these kind of things kind of fall off a little bit like I'm fairly certain Brest was one of our first technicals but as rocker technical he's also kind of still not master sergeant yeah oh boy okay so I don't think we have a squad for this mission which is fine we're gonna gonna see we have this jailbreak coming back in Um, we also got a reduced contact cost just uh, from the previous mission here. This was already reduced. So maybe New Mexico is reduced now. I want to boost the UFO. I want to boost this thing. Jailbreak was fine. Right, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna scan and rest in course for the Western European ward. And we're gonna have the jailbreak ready for the next episode. And then I'll, I'll decide later on what we do with the intel. We're also gonna spend some intel on Shadow Chamber research in a second. Shadow Chamber now operational. New objective added. We are fully prepared to begin our analysis of the material. Uh, what are you doing right now? Advanced site, Commander. With the shadow chamber fully operational, we can use its advanced decryption capabilities to analyze the codex artifact recovered by our forces. Yeah, just just don't break my trailer chamber in the process, please. Commander, we've had the shadow chamber running the numbers. These are the tactical projections for our next field operation. Right. You're gonna need Spectre, Codex Swiper Lead, Advent Guardian, Longbow Priest, Lancer, Hunter Drone. On automated defenses map, that's um I assume Shadow Chamber doesn't list turrets. There's probably gonna be turrets there. Double Shinobi, Technical Gunner Assault Specialist. Yeah, I think we're running this in 10 to 12. So we're gonna run this next. And by next, I mean in the next episode. Thanks for watching. See you next time.